Yesterday should have been the perfect mood and uh, situation to make this last offering. The fourth shloka I have included after a second thought only as something like an index, something like a appendix, explanation of Janma Bri Pravavardini which we saw taught yesterday, meditated upon. <coughs> but it is proper that the Upakrama and Upasamara should be the same. So we want to, to come to this place. We want to touch this shloka. It's in no way less important. <coughs> because it talks about various sadhanas. In a very mystical way, not very explicitly. The one point which you should remember, and I don't think it is wrong to reiterate it again and again. Bhagavati Kundalini is the fundamental spiritual force for sadhana. But it is not the only sadhana.
Kundalini only implements, reinforces, facilitates the various sadhanas told in the Shruti. So that word Shruti Mati included in the third shloka is very important. In the name of Kundalini Yoga, Shakti Pata, I don't know what all. In the name of entire Tantra, they have defamed, desecrated Vedanta. That cannot be tolerated. <clears throat> so don't be carried away by all the talk that there is about Kundalini and the in number of books being published. <clears throat> it is the Agamas themselves say the most gopaniya. It should not be discussed at all. Only Guru Sishyas can talk about it, not the public. Matriyoni mm-hmm. Vat. She is the Matriyoni. She is the Mata and she is the Brahmayoni. Out of which Brahmagnana comes. So those who do not do any sadhana prescribed in the scriptures, Kundalini becomes irrelevant. If they indulge in it, it becomes dangerous. So this point has to be borne in mind. She is there behind every little one of your sadhanas. Because Kundalini is the mana, Kundalini is the vak, Kundalini is the buddhi. These are all various forms of the Kundalini force. I am glad Premaspada Sadyoji mentioned about mantra. I, I was not in, there to hear it. But it is very closely connected with Kundalini. So Mantra Yoga, Kundalini Yoga. (coughs) So I told you in the so-called petals of the lotuses in the chakras, each petal is allotted a group of the alphabets. Mm. Varna Mala. (coughs) So when we meditate upon the Shakti within you, just before you start your meditations. Adare Linganabo Prakatita Vivave Talumu Lela Late Dipatre Shodashare Dishadashadale Dwadasharke Chatushke Ham Cham Tatvarta Yuktam Sakalatanugatam All these chakras, I won't go into it, huh? though you are tempted to write all. Vasante, Balamadye, Dapakata Saite, Kantadeshe, Swaranam, these chakras, all the Varnamala are there. Ham, Sham, Tatvarta, Yuktam, Sakalatanagatam, Varnarupam Namami. All the literature in the whole world. Whether Sanskrit or Greek, they are all contained within this Varnamala only. <laughs> mm. So Kundalini is intimately connected. She is the walk. She manifests the walk. So again I repeat, only in human body Kundalini works. Only in the human body there is walk. Mm. You see the significance of She is the mana. Just now I was praying to the Lord, Manaste Padabje Nivasatu, in the words of Bhagavan Bhashakara. You have to think of the Lord's marana. That mana also is Kundalini. 
द स्पेशल माइंड नीडेड कुंडलिनी प्रसादित मन नहीं है तो भजन में जा ही नहीं सकते आई थिंक यू डिड विमर्श ऑन मई एव मन दत्स्व मई बुद्धि निवेश आई डोंट नो वॉट यू डिड I don't know whether you caught hold of what the mana is. <laughs> very tricky, very subtle. <clears throat> That mana is upheld by the Kundalini only. In as much as the Kundalini Yoga is done, so much the mind will become brighter, more suitable, able. Mana seva no drishta vyam. without buddhi you cannot do dhyana at all manaste pada abjeni vasatu me my mind think of your lotus feet my lord vacha hastotra panito me use words to extol you karaucha abhyarchayam me my limbs be always employed in your worship your work your seva श्रुतिर कथाकर्णन विद मे मई इयर्स वी आलवेज एम्प्लॉड फॉर हेरिंग युवर ग्लोरी तव ध्यान बुद्धि नयन युगल मूर्ति विभव एंड मे ईस् वांडरिंग वेर वर् मे ईस् वांडर मे सी युवर दिव्य विग्रह अष्टमूर्ति If I do it, paragranthan kairva bashikara says after writing hundreds of granthas. <laughs> What other grantha do I need? Do I need to read a book? Mm. But it's very essential. I will tell you, <laughs> Shastra. All this is supported by Kundalini. Uh, so called Kundalini Yoga, you do. and you have nothing to do with this marana bhajana kirtana <laughs> so the question is is the sadhaka first doing these sadhanas what i say may not refer to you who are present here but i am afraid most sadhakas don't do any sadhana they are sadhakas because they have been initiated they have been initiated because i don't know why <laughs> <laughs> because some mantra was whispered into their ears they are sadhakas because they have they have clung to that mantra they do japa once in a year or once in two years they meet the guru So the guru asks, "How are you? How oh, my my son has got a job? No, I mean to say, how are you? <laughs> I'm all right. Do you going doing this? Yes. I always remember your mantra. Acha. How long do you do? So I mean, you know, I am in Bombay. Bombay life, you know, time is the problem. So while taking bath, I do." <laughs> someone leads a faster life so he says while driving the car to the office i do japa acha japa do any swadhyaya you do ha oh, yes yes what do you do no i i recite the hanuman chalisa acha you you recite it Um, actually you see it's uh, it's very difficult so i play that recorded alright <laughs> you don't do any satsanga oh yes yes we do satsanga while taking breakfast i put on the aastha channel <laughs> aastha channel what is that oh some big big people come Oh, what is that, Bapu? Asharam Bapu comes, Shri Shri comes, comes sometimes Jaggi Vasudev comes. 
अच्छा दैट इज देर सच फिनिश यू हैव टू डू वाइब्रेंट साधना इंटेंस साधना डोंट बी डेल्यूडेड दैट यू आर ए साधक बिकॉज यू डू दिस आई एम रिमाइंडेड ऑफ दैट स्टोरी अबाउट the couple who were on a holiday <coughs> some goa or some place like that. they checked into the hotel late so they wanted to go a little bit they put off the lights and retired for the night <coughs> to one thief he was watching this room is away separately nice near the edge of the forest so he broke into the room <coughs> they put out a revolver the man got a what is this noise something coming through the window <coughs> was all, he showed the don't say one word and i shoot you then with one hand he drew a with the chalk a circle he said come and stand here hmm. in his underwear hmm. stand here don't move i shoot you don't make a noise and don't move you he was petrified then he collected whatever he could put in the bag some mobile all these things when something was there near the bed when he went he discovered there something else in the bed also the lady had nicely covered herself he removed the sheet he found this lady get up get up i'll shoot you she stand here she stood there he saw now this man was petrified it turned out to be a, i think mary com or something like that such a tall what <laughs> mary com you know <laughs> then he calmed down a little <laughs> he said you are nice can you dance <laughs> don't worry i won't touch you dare not <laughs> he took out his mobile and played some tune mm, at least let me have some entertainment mm. make some moments mm. make or i shoot i what to do even a boxer can dance no she made some moment oh he was so nice and when the music and dances that you feel like dance so he also started dancing <laughs> 